my dear friends, welcome back to Be Spice. This is Rambala with you. This video will be a promotional video on Be Spice activities uh, on the detail uh, and uh, uh, instrumentation design and detail engineering. Many of you are asking whether B Spice, you know, is uh, conducting any courses or any online lectures. So this video will answer all those queries. So if you want to learn instrumentation design and detail engineering, you can approach me at any point of time. I'm willing to support. In fact. In B Spice, we have uploaded most of the videos. What I'm going to explain in this uh, uh, session, uh, whatever I uploaded in B Spice already is marked in blue, and whichever is in black is yet to be uploaded. So this is the short and sweet update I want to give you all. And before going into the uh, agenda or maybe the details, I would like to thank all of you for your continuous support. Your support is, you know, done a lot of good for us, for our channel, and we have grown well. And keep supporting and keep watching, friends. Okay? So let's move on with that. First, I want to tell you about me. Almost 110, 112 videos we have uploaded. But, you know, I never informed you all about my profile, background. Of course, many of you know through LinkedIn. But this is, this is just, a, you know, a small, uh, uh, you know, uh, intro. Okay, uh, my name is uh, Ramalinga Balachandar. Of course, uh, the short name, Rambala. So I've been working for uh, 26 years in instrumentation design. Uh, control and automation, plan maintenance also, and of course, procurement, project management, and also specialized in asset management, inspection. And of course, I, I execute a lot of you know jobs and uh, uh, took part in construction and commissioning also. And off late, I was also involved in training actually, particularly. In fact, uh, uh, during my tenure in Yokogawa, I was uh, part of the training division. And I was a certified, uh, you know, uh, trainer as well. Yeah, in addition to my engineering uh, prof profile. Okay, so basically, uh, I'm involved in onshore oil and gas, refinery, petrochemical, terminal automation, uh, power plant. Uh, in fact, the, uh, the current uh, project is power plant. And of course, a pulp and paper, water treatment, sewage treatment. All these are our plans, and this is my the current profile waste to energy for plan and offshore. Also, I've done a bit of you know top sides platform and FSRU uh, and FLNG and FGSS systems. Okay, so employees, uh, uh, employers like in Middle East, I worked as a team leader uh, managing the you know downstream for this uh, Oman refinery and petrochemical industries now called as OQ. And for Far East, uh, worked in Singapore, Japan, Korea, and Thailand. And these are the companies, Yokogawa. I worked as engineering manager, then Siemens yeah, as a senior engineer, then Chioda as a lead engineer, Keppel Gas Technology, Singapore as a lead engineer. And currently, I'm working for Biniz Yekam JV. Uh, it's uh, part of the you know National Environment Agency sponsored uh, waste to energy project. Okay, friends. So, of course, in India also, Prior to Singapore, in India, I worked in Yokogawa, Reliance, and Magindra. This is about my short profile, friends. Anything, I am reachable here. Okay, let's move on with that. See, the aim, friends, why I started this B-Spice? To improve the industrial knowledge base of the would-be instrumentation engineer by inculcating the latest trends and modern technologies of industrial arena which should help, you know, to meet the challenges ahead. So that is the aim, actually. That is why I started this YouTube. Okay, right. So the focus is uh, basically the nascent uh, theoretical ideas of uh, our engineers uh, shall be enhanced and diversified to the next level to meet the possible challenges to be encountered during the interviews, higher studies, and on-job assignments. And, of course, the ultimate focus is to bring the 
industrial know-how and knowledge and engineering deliverables inside the college campus. So that was, in fact, I target this uh, universities. And in fact, I also delivering, uh, you know, lectures in some of the, you know, reputed colleges uh, in India. And of course, if any of the HOD or lecturers, professors uh, watching this video, if you want to have a, you know, a kind of training, you can approach me. Okay, I'm willing to support. Right, friends. So the target is final year, of course, ENI and final year INC. And of course, the graduate engineering trainees. That was my target. But in fact, it is applicable for the, I mean, what do you call uh, the intermediate engineers also. In fact, uh, some of the topics which we, we have covered is also applicable for the experienced engineers also. Now, that one you will agree when you, when you, you know, uh, go through this, uh, uh, what do you call, syllabus. So what are all the areas of expertise uh, we are planning to deliver or plan already delivered? Okay. So one is the mastering p &D. So the blue means we are already uploaded in our channel. You can watch and get benefited. Okay. In that, what is p &D, functions and purpose of p &D, classifications of p &D, you know, when to use and who will use the p and p and support documentation. What should p and include? The structure and information, the, the legend sheet, common items in p and then valves in control loops, uh, and also the primary elements in the p and and how process operations are controlled, and how to trace a process flow on p and and p and for instrumentation, okay? So these are the things we covered in three volumes, actually. The first one is talk about, you know, one, two, uh, yeah, one to nine, then 10, 11, 12 is in the part two, and p and exclusively for instrumentation engineers in part three. Okay, friends, you can watch and get benefited. This is already done. Any questions? Yeah, you can come for a live chat. Okay, uh, we can have a, you know, live chat and we can have a, you know, detailed discussion. So the next one is the instrument index. Like we, we, we want to cover the structure, the parameters, the applications, and of course the hands-on with previous projects. Okay, then similarly the input I, I will list it. Okay. Input, output, please. Structure, parameters, the DCS1, ESD, VMS, all these. Then application and hands-on previous uh, with previous projects. So the, then there's a transmitter design. In fact, this blue means we are already covered. Instrument selection criteria, data sheets, in fact, for pressure, level, flow, temperature, valves, everything we are done. We are only left out with analyzer, which I am going to focus very soon. Okay. And of course, the material requisition, specification, all these uh, hands on with previous. Uh, I'm going to cover very soon. Okay, friends. Of course, the specification is part of this actually. Data sheet is the main part of the specification, but there is some, you know, write up required. So those things also I'm going to cover. So that's about the transmitter. Then analyzer, analyzer selection criteria, the data sheet preparation for all type of analyzer. Okay. Analyze shelter, material requisition, specification, hands-on previous uh, projects. This is the one which I am going to do uh, very soon. Okay, friends. Right. Then, nest loading, I/O assignment. The assignment criteria, methodology, application, all these we already covered and uploaded. You can watch and get benefited. Okay. Then the cable schedule. It's going to come very soon. Structure, contents, and the application, specification, system cable schedule, and hands-on with the previous project references. All these. Uh, see, hands-on in the sense, if you are coming for the live session, uh, we can have all these uh, hands-on. But of course, if you are, uh, you know, uh, uh, prefer to watch in YouTube, you can still, you know, uh, uh, you know, look into this all, whatever we have covered. And if anything, questions, you can write to me, actually. Uh, okay? You, you can become a member. And you can, you know, uh, you can uh, chat actually. And of course, you can come for the live uh, chats also. And add on also, like cable selection, how to select a cable and uh, conduit sizing, cable glands, all these we are going to cover. Then layout drug, very, very important. Actually, I'm already having a lot of materials on this, but I'm just waiting for, you know, uh, things to improve, meaning... Uh, uh, just started off with the field instrumentation. They're now focusing on the systems, the controls, all these. Once it is done, then I'll focus on this. So instrument layout, instrument LCB, local control panel, junction box, control room layout, cable layout, cable tray layout, cable tray sizing, voltage, uh, cable sizing, 
voltage drop calculation, all these we are going to cover. Okay. Then hookup drawing for the pressure gauge, pressure transmitter, differential pressure, level transmitter, flow transmitter, control valves, all these we are going to cover very soon. Okay. Coming up. Junction box, overview. It's like a type, sizing and selection, how to write the design specification and how to come out with the, you know, develop the GA and IA. GA means general arrangement, IA means internal arrangement. Then bill of material, all these are related to junction box. Then marshalling panel. In fact, we have uploaded in detail actually already. Overview, design spec, GA, IA, BOM, all these we already covered. Okay. Then control panel. Overview, racks, FTA, IO, power supply, design spec, GAIA, BOM, all these we already covered. Then grounding scheme and everything also we covered. Overview, design spec, uh, all these we already covered in our B-Swipe channel. And loop drawing. Uh, loop drawing means overview, the structure, the look and feel, the standards uh, to be followed, all these we are going to cover. And also the application part. Uh, and hands on with previous projects. Uh. Then orifice design. In fact, exclusive uh, detail uh, already uploaded, types of the standards, the data sheets, and in fact, the sizing also I have uploaded already. Okay, right. Then control wall. Control wall type standards already covered, data sheets also covered, design consideration also covered. In fact, uh, many of you actually wanted to have a live session on the sizing, and uh, it's going to be uh, started very soon. I will notify you. You can join the live session, and we can have a one a live example with the latest projects, uh, control wall sizing. Okay, friends? Right. Yeah, this is the one add on sizing. Right. Then on off also similarly, type standard data sheet design considerations. Okay. Then motor operated wall. In fact, we have already uploaded type standards, data sheets, design. All these we have already covered. Okay. Then material takeoff, overview. BOM, Bill of Material, hands-on with previous projects. This, we are going to cover it very soon. Okay. Then process control narrative, overview and structure. This is what I'm going to, actually, it's under process. Uh, I'll be uploading uh, very soon. Very soon means perhaps this will be the next video. Okay. Right. Then the control logics, overview and structure. Then later strand, like a hot, uh, Highway addressable, remote transducer, we already uploaded. Mod bus also, we already uploaded. Profi bus, profi net, foundation field bus. In fact, foundation field bus, an exclusive master series we uploaded. Okay, friends, you can uh, watch and get benefit. Distributed control system, extensively we covered overview, specification, what are all the selection criteria, architecture, in fact, in detail doubt in, with the example of Yokogawa DCS and the previous project references. Okay, friends, right? All these I already given, okay, right? Then PLC SCADA, which we'll be taking up very soon, selection criteria and specification and architecture, okay, right? Then system engineering. We have already covered extensively, overview, the deliverables, all this. Then project engineering also, we have covered already. Process controls. Uh, we have recently covered, in fact, on off, feed forward, cascade, ratio, split range. Uh, all these we have already covered with the uh, uh, Yokogawa uh, system, actually. Right, friends? Right. Then, industrial process. I want to touch upon also, give you some, you know, outline about the refinery, petrochemical, power, sugar, cement, reverse osmosis, water treatment, waste to energy. All these processes I am going to uh, provide you. Okay. Then hazardous area classification. We have done already a very detailed video on this. Overview, application, all these we have already covered. You can watch and get benefited. Then smart plan instrumentation. Overview and application, I'm planning to do it. Of course, uh, what my intention or my liking is, I want to actually uh, buy a software for this and I want to give a hands-on training. That, my, that, was my, that is my long-term goal. But currently, I'll touch upon the overview in the application portal. Okay. Right. Then cybersecurity, OT side. Huh? Okay. Uh, yeah. Operational technology. Okay. IT, cybersecurity, IT is there. And of course, we are not very specialized IT. Our limitation is OT. Okay. We'll go with this OT. Okay. Right. And asset management. Of course, I've done ex I mean, extensive work on this. I'm going to explain with the help of Yokogawa PRM. This is also under pipeline. Okay. 
then automation system overview. Yokogawa extensively I've covered already. Siemens to be taken up, Emerson to be taken up, Honeywell to some extent we covered. In fact, one of our viewers actually asked, yeah, I'm going to actually have this uh, as a you know overview initially to start with, but in the long term, I'm going to have a, you know my own school of engineering, uh, physical, you know, the real school. And in that I'll, you know, have this all this system in place so that, you know, students or any uh, freshers can come and, you know, have a hands on. So that's my uh, uh, future plan, actually. Okay. Of course, ABB, all this. Then HAZAP, we have already covered extensively. You can watch and get benefited. Then SIL, recently we uploaded SIL uh, uh, classification, verification, all this. And the international standards we have covered extensively, meaning A to Z. Think about A alphabet and go up to Z. All standards we have covered. In fact, it was well received by people. Then also, I want to touch upon a bit on Shell DEP, Exxon Mobil GP, uh, Oman Refineries uh, specification, Adnox, Saudi Aramco, all these. Uh, of course, uh, you know, this is, I, I cannot share any document because of the copyrights and all. But I can tell you, actually, I can tell you based on my experience. In fact, I work for Shell. I work for exam. I, I was, uh, you know, a team leader in open, Oman refineries. This one, I have gathered some information I can share with you. And Saudi Aramco also, I worked in some projects. Okay, friends, right. And package system. What are all the overview on the interface and what are all the deliverables we need to focus on the package system? See, package system means like compressor, all these, okay. Then the commercial part, proposal and estimation, how to do the proposal and estimation, how to calculate the engineering maneuvers, the MTO, costing, all these also I'm planning, okay? And uh, this is the conclusion, friends. At the end of this training, there would be instrumentation professionals and easily adapt to the growing trend in industrial arena and confidently find a greener pasture in their quest for a glorious professional career especially in engineering domain. So this is what I want to say, friends. Um, this is what I'm going to cover. And of course, this is not limited uh, because, you know, learning is something that never end and there are many things to learn. And as we progress, as, uh, you know, depends on your support, you know, then we can, you know, develop this course content to the next level by adding a lot of new, new things, actually, okay? And initially, the plan is to have this uh, training online. Saturday, Sunday, I'm available. You can, you know, approach anytime. And I'm willing to support you guys. And of course, uh, if there is, a, you know, a group, uh, number of people is are there, then we can plan some like every Saturday, two hours, every Sunday, two hours like that. Okay. Or other words, you want to watch my YouTube, you can become a member. Okay. Uh, yeah, of course, it's a it's going to be a paid, uh, you know, membership very soon. So you can become a member and uh, yeah, you can raise any queries and you can participate in the live streams. Huh? Okay, we can have a one to one chat, whatever. It's up to you, actually. Okay, friends. So anything you want to enhance this, uh, what do you call the syllabus, the contents, you are please uh, uh, free, uh, free to write to bspice for you at gmail.com. Let us work together and learn big and live big. Thank you, friends. Bye-bye. Take care.